Hey, Graham Nation, Dixie Jean here. Standing with Patrick Kilpatrick, you look like a fighter yourself. You were saying something about a movie black belt. What is this about? Well, I call it movie black belt because when you're preparing for movies or television shows, whatever physical thing is there, and there have been a lot of uh, martial arts, like I'm, I'm always playing the evil sensei or something like that. So you, you practice the martial arts. It's almost like a dance for us. Having been killed by, you know, everybody <laughs> from Jean Claude Van Damme to Steven Seagal and all of that. So you end up doing that dance. It's a choreography. Um, I was always an athlete, so they were always giving me physical parts. Well, we recognize you from Minority Report. Yeah. Um, you look you had to like pretend you're building to up. Could beat me up there. You had to pretend? Yeah. Well, if you're the villain, sooner or later you can catch a good one. But always come back. Always on top. Mm -hmm. Now, going into it, did you always want to act? No, I was a journalist and an advertising writer for uh, about 10 years and, and actually wrote for most of the magazines and a lot of the articles. And then, so I wrote a play that got produced in New York. I kind of came through that. Rather than okay. coming through mixed martial arts, I came through writing. Well, you like. Well, you said you wrote a play, so you like the live, yeah. live um, acting. Well, coming into this, how is it watching live cage fights? I mean, it's not a choreographed This fight. is my first time. First oh, time? For, for choreography? You know, for us, it's just a dance. It's like learning the lines. We learn the moves, and you get so that you can do it very, very, very quickly. To make it look fluid. Yeah. And then uh, you do it once with passion. You don't want to have to do it ten times. Right. Because somebody will get hurt. Um, so, uh, and people do get hit. You get hit, you get injured, but you try to, it's kind of a breakdown of track. Right. You know, you add up where you can. A lot of costumes are, are selected so that you can hide things. Particularly if you don't have the mess that you can fall into, like a concrete place or fighting over. Yeah, you don't look like a guy who would have a stud double. I had a stud double. His name was Dave Rout for many years. But generally, you end up having to do all of it yourself yeah. on some level, except in really, really extremely dangerous stuff. Very rarely do they let you do that, because if you get really injured or killed, well, the then the you know. movie is true. Yeah. So uh, Dave did some memorable uh, stunts for me, like in Last Man Standing. He got blown up the board. But I did some ratchets in my day. That was caused by a ratchet. You put a, a harness on it and get yanked out the board. Um, Wait, were you mentioning this is your first fight that you've been to live? This will be my first live fight, although I'm a huge UFC fan. So going into it, uh, what are you expecting inside? You know, the energy of a live performance, like uh, going to a stage. By the way, uh, when I say that, I went to all the Ali and Foreman fights uh, as I was growing up and that kind of thing, and live football and that kind of thing. But this will be my first uh, MMA fight live. Now, being in a cage, what's the... Well, I think the things that we all love doing when we're looking at competitions like that, we, we love to see great competitions, say like DeSantos and, uh, and uh, Cain Velasquez. When these guys really fight and they, they leave it all in, in the ring, that's what you really want to see. I, I think it gets a little boring for people if it's a... Uh, Sometimes it's an extremely technical fight, and that it's a lot of grappling. Yeah. That can often get a little slow. Mm -hmm. um, so you want to see a lot of footwork. I like a ground game, but uh, you want to make sure that it's constantly fluid and everybody's really trying to gain an advantage. Well, it's nice to see a live sort of dance. Sure. It comes out victorious for these I have fights. tremendous respect for these guys. I, you know, I was sort of been an athlete all my life in one way or another. I, I know where I'm being put into it. In order to succeed in this, you have to be extremely dedicated. I'm looking forward to it. Well, I'm, I hope you enjoy inside. I'm sure I will. I'm, I'm loving being with you here. All right, thank you, Patrick. We'll thank see you. Next time. See you. Thank you.